welcome friends to my channel today i am going to show you how to reset a hikvision ip camera password if you have forgotten the password or if your camera is locked how to reset the password to do this we need some equipment we need a 12 volt power adapter and a patch cord so let's start the video next step is to install the SADP tool uh, we have to install this and you have to download it so for downloading just type SADP tool downloads the, the first link what you will get from the Higvision click on it and this website you can see there is a download option the download option you can download this is the near about 100, 100 mbps 100 megabyte uh, space required for that it is downloading so as you can see my download is over I click on it for installation it can be installed via the very simple steps you can install this so we have to click on next and the installation is complete so now our SADP tool installation is complete step the next step is to power up the Higvision camera so I am using this 12 volt adapter for powering up so I connect to this power connector and I use this uh, patch cord the one end is connected to the uh, camera terminal and another another end I connect to the ethernet port of the computer so this is all over power connection and cable interface is over. As we started the SADP tool, you can see one camera is detected that DS2CD1023GOEI. So now we have to select this camera and as the we don't know the password or suppose we give a wrong password also and it says that the wrong password remaining 6 attempt so after 6 attempt it will be locked so now we have to reset the password so we need to click on we need to click on this uh, option called forget password once you click on this option called forget password there is a uh, imp you have to import the file so first for that we have to first export the file so click on this export option and save the file in any location for suppose uh, I save in a particular folder uh, the I give the name now select the folder and see it shows the file is exported so now if you go to the particular folder we can see the file so now I am in this capture folder and you can see that this is the file what we have been exported. Now we have to save this file to the Hig to Higvision support for the decoded file. So now we have to send this file via the email. We have to send this, that exported file to the support of the Higvision. The email ID is supportpremahigvision.com and in subject you should write down that password reset and in this uh, body of this you provide your name organization address pin code the details so as you can see I have given my details now I have to attach that particular exported file which I saved in my computer so I just select that particular exported file and click open I have attached and send this email so after sending this email so I can see you can see in the same mail it is showing at 758 I have sent so the decoded decoded file will be coming between 15 to 1 hour 15 minutes to 1 hour you will get the decoded file from the support now friends as you can see I have received the encrypted encrypted one from the support so I will open that 
there will be attachment at the end you can see this is called encrypted key I have to download it and we need to store it to an appropriate location so I copy and I keep in a specific folder now we have to upload this encrypted key to our STA SADP tool so now we have to click on this import and we have to select the file which we received from the Higvision this encrypted key and you have to open it now we have to give a new password so I give a new password we have to confirm it and we have to press confirm so as you can press the confirm you can see that it shows reset password successfully now we can change everything suppose I want to change the IP address suppose I want to change the IP address so I am changing it so I change to this one and now if I ask for modify it will ask for the input the admin password so the password which I set I will give it now you can see parameter modification modified successfully so now your camera is ready now we will log log into the camera from the browser and we will see whether the camera can be viewed or not now we will log into the camera camera link so i have entered the ip address of the camera and i now press press enter when i press enter see i will not get the any display because we need to remember one thing generally most of the computer ip address in, in the dynamic ip address so we have to keep change the ip address from dynamic to static ip address also that is in the same class that is 192 range so we need to change the ip address of the computer so first we will go to the network settings and here in local ID network i will change the ipv4 settings See, see here it is shown the IP address automatically from here I have to change to the use the following IP address now I can give any IP address of the same class where my camera is there so I just give uh, suppose 5 because uh, my camera IP address is also in the same range so submit mask you can keep as it is no problem ok it is now set now if you just enter press enter we will be directed to the camera login page as you can see I have been directed to the camera login page here I have to give the username as admin and we have to see give the password which we gave during the setting the camera so I press login so see I am now in login mode so here I have been asked to install the plugin so now you can see friends <coughs> the camera is online we can see so this is how we can reset the uh, locked camera or uh, old camera so hope you have enjoyed the video thank you for watching if you have any query please give in the comment box